Hello there, it's Sam from Certus here and welcome back to another Two Minute Tuesday. Now that I've covered off the vast majority of our products in previous Two Minute Tuesdays, production series videos and shorts, it's time to have a look at some of the FAQs we receive here at Certus from contractors. One of these questions is, can I use an AOV as an access hatch? Before I tell you the answer, I just want to draw your attention to a product which may help you with this issue. This is the Certus Roof Access Hatch Residential. I've done some videos on this product recently, so if you're interested in finding out some more, I'll leave a link to those along with the RAHR product page down below. And finally, if it is AOVs you're after, I'll leave a link to our product page below where you can see a wide array of Certus products. Anyway, can you use an AOV as an access hatch? Well, it's a great solution for if you're tight for space on the roof of your project, but there are some considerations you'll need to be aware of. The main consideration is, it's a genuine possibility that someone could get stranded on the roof in the event of a smoke ventilation system resetting. With this in mind, you'll need to add an access key switch to the smoke ventilation control system to allow the access hatch to open. This can either be internal or ideally both internally and externally. Generally, it's good practice to keep life safety systems for the function they were designed for, rather than integrating them with other systems, such as access systems. However, it's possible and common to provide access with roof vents. Although it's a good idea to ensure that the vent you're using for access has been tested with the motor offset. It's very easy to offset a motor, but make sure the product has been tested in that manner. This is because you don't want to do anything that would avoid the declaration of performance. I hope that's cleared up your question. And as always, if there's anything our friendly team can do to help, please do give us a call or a live chat. I'll leave a link to our contact us page in the description below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again very soon.